this ruby crown kinglet collided with a window on January 13th. When he would try to fly, he would flip onto his back, and he had a head tick. Over the next few days, the head tick improved with treatment. Birds can get concussions just like people and need medical care to reduce brain swelling and inflammation. He also had trouble accurately picking up insects, but that improved with treatment. Ringo was one of our tiniest patients, weighing 6.1 grams or a quarter of an ounce. If you find a window collision victim, place them in a ventilated box lined with towels, place the box in a safe, quiet place, then contact a rehabber. Window and building collisions claim millions of birds annually in the United States, and this species is one of the top 20 most commonly found birds during Project Safe Flight Monitoring. After several days of treatment, Ringo's head tick was gone, his feeding behavior was normal, and he was soon flying again. After just over two weeks of care, Ringo took his freedom flight on January 29th. Why do birds collide with windows? They can't see glass. They see a continuation of their surroundings. And light pollution contributes by confusing birds during nighttime migration. And this isn't just a big city problem. About 40% of collisions occur in residential areas. Please visit Birds Georgia for more information.